really neat reintroduction projects all across the range now that we're excited about. The BAMP reintroduction is one of them. It's a tremendous story. These things take a long time and they take champions like Harvey and Mary Ann to really push them and push them and push them. And they eventually do root. And so we're pretty excited that BAMP could have bison back in that landscape again. There's another good one that's going on down in Grand Canyon and it's in, in the Kaibab forest and some work with the Arizona, the state of Arizona. You're on the phone with somebody, you said, I gotta go to the phone already. I know, the town of Fast. Uh -huh. Good afternoon, everyone. I come from uh, Kabango Zambezi Transfrontier Conservation Area, which is uh, in southern Africa, that biggest dot on the African uh, map there. In my spare time, I'm the President and CEO of the Montana Chamber of Commerce, and we welcome you to uh, to Montana if you're visiting from elsewhere, uh, north of the border. Glad to have our Canadian friends here. Uh, and, uh, yeah. It's my pleasure to welcome all of you to the 84th Rotary Peace Park Celebration. This annual event brings together Rotarians and members of the Waterton Glacier International Peace Park Association, WGIPPA. This year we're especially honored to be joined by a group of international guests who convened earlier this week to share their knowledge and expertise about international peace parks around the globe. Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light what so we hail at the twilight's last gleaming, whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous night o'er the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming, and the rockets red glare the bombs were singing. Thank you. 